beautiful. Right, here's the exciting bit. It's time to get messy because I've come up with some crazy South African fruit recipes that you can try with your mates at home. Okay, to do this, I need an assistant. Hayley, in you come. This is Hayley, she's super cool. Okay, what you need is a whole bunch of these beautiful plums because we're gonna make fruit leather, which is fruit that's been sort of dehydrated so it's really nice and tough. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna chop them in half and then into quarters and you can take the stones out from it. That's brilliant, Hayley, absolutely beautiful. Okay, you can take that and put it in the oven. So, what you've got to do is you've got to take those plums and put them in the oven at 200 degrees centigrade for about 20 or 30 minutes to roast them down a little bit. Then, you put them all in a food processor and you blitz them to smithereens until you've got a big mush of plums. And then you add a little bit of caster sugar and lay them all out in that baking tray all over again. Stick them in the oven and then put the oven temperature down to a really low heat, like sort of 60, 70, 80 degrees, and you leave them there overnight. It's a long time, you've got to be patient. And then, when you're finished, it looks a bit like this. Okay, Haley, in you come. Wow. Okay, so this is what we made earlier. And this is what you get. It's basically fruit leather. So then, you have to chop it up. Okay, let's chop this one up in, through the middle. Oh, it's really firm. Okay, Haley, see if you can roll that one up for me. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, Haley, time to try it. What do you think? Excellent. So this next recipe is even simpler, and it's really cool because it's very, very messy. So we're gonna make something called Eaton Mess, but we're gonna call it South African Fruit Mess. Okay, so the first thing you got is meringues. Now, Hayley, can you break up all those meringues for me? Just make a real mess out of them, that's cool. Okay, when they're all beautifully mushed up like that, you need to add some of this stuff. This is whipped cream. Okay, Hayley, can you get that whipped cream and put a third of it onto each of these plates for me? Beautiful, okay. I'll finish that off for you. Beautiful, that's absolutely perfect. Now, we're gonna take all the mashed up meringues and we're gonna scatter them all over the cream. Okay, grab some of these. Like that. Oh. Now the big star of this dish is the fruit. So I've got some beautiful peaches, some apples, and some of these lovely, lovely pears. I've chopped them up already, and you just take a big handful of them. You grab a big handful there, Hayley and scatter them all over your mess. There's only one thing left to do, and that's to try it. And I've got some of the smallest assistants I've ever had in my life to have a go. Okay, guys, dig in. You can have a little try there. Okay, so what do you think, guys? Let's go! Yay! 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 <laughs> there are loads of brilliant recipes for using South African fruit. Go to the website beautifulcountrybeautifulfruit.com and if you can, make a mess.